Hi guys, this is Ali Magbira and this is a review of the Little Flap Hipster and the pattern is Baroque. Uh, this is the very first Baroque item I bought uh, from Vera Bradley. I tend to, as you probably can tell by my other videos, I tend to veer towards the pinks and sometimes blues. Um, and so black is not a pattern that I will probably purchase, but I really like this one because I also like simplicity in the patterns. And this is one that, that is not very busy and I like. It only has a few colors, the black on the background. It has a dark gray, white, and um, greenish kind of yellow. So uh, it is a great pattern uh, for that reason because it's simple and it's, I found it very elegant, especially for a bag like this, which is a use for evening outings um, and so let's get started on this review okay the bag is small it's only eight inches by seven it has a depth of an inch and three quarters it is completely quilted on the front and on the back but not on the bottom or sides let's talk about the side um, from the side it is it has a triangular shape and it's uh, bigger towards the bottom so it helps you, allows you rather to put more items in it, uh, but it still not seem very bulky. It has an adjustable strap and let me see, it adjusts right here. So you can, you have the option of carrying it as a shoulder bag or as a crossbody. I use it as a crossbody uh, because it's just more comfortable for me. Okay, it has a decorative, decorative stripe right on the top. Uh, of the front but nothing on the back there is nothing nothing on the back of this bag but it has plenty of room um, in other places okay so it has this uh, front zip zipper uh, pocket it has the de decorative uh, ribbons on it and inside it is uh, not quilted but it is a fabric material with the contrasted um, pattern for Baroque it's very beautiful I really like that pattern actually um and um the pocket goes all the way down and all the way across the bag i use this to put some gum in it but mind you that there's room for a whole lot more in there so it's a great little pocket the name comes from the fact that it has a flap on the front it has a very strong <laughs> as you can tell uh, snap uh, magnetic closure right there um, the good thing about this bag is that you do not need to carry a wallet with it because it has a built-in wallet. So on the back of the flap, that's the flap, on the back of it, you can, it has a window, uh, ID and you can put your picture ID in there, which is what I did. And it also has this, uh, second zipper compartment, which you can use as a wallet. It has a built-in wallet in it with the ribbons, of course, and... This is how it looks like inside. It is, um, again, it has a fabric uh, uh, inside pattern in there. It has two, let's see, one and two um, slots where you can put your credit card or debit card. I put it in here, my debit card, and on the second one, I put my credit card and um, you can fit more than one car in each one of these slots if you need to i use the rest of it to carry my cash coins and um, cash in there so it worked just fine for me okay on the top it has another zipper compartment again with the same pattern inside it's just um it goes all all the way all the size of the bag so it's all the way down all the way across I use this to carry my cell phone only I thought it was a handy place to put it in there um, I chose not to put it over here I guess you could if you want to but I didn't because uh, it makes it kind of heavy and so when you open this thing you know you don't want to um, it's gonna be just too heavy for it was at least for me too heavy uh, to do that so I didn't I just use it over here and it worked just fine now on the back it has another snap closure and that's where you see the depth of the bag in there 
I don't know if you can tell, but like from here to here, that's the bottom of the bag. Okay, I used that to carry my sunglasses case. Uh, it worked just fine for that. And I also had in there a little pouch, very, very small pouch with um, mirror and my lipstick um, just for the evening, like I said. So it worked just fine for that. Uh, that it's about it for this bag. Great little bag for evening outings. Uh, the day, the last time I, I carried it, I was uh, dressed all in black. So I thought this bag would you know give a little bit of a you know a punch in there for uh, some color for my outfit and it was really really great uh, bag to carry like I said in the evening I could see myself uh, using this bag for maybe just a small trip to the store as well I tend to carry a whole lot more things in my purses which is why I usually do not carry it during the day but if you're a minimalist which I'm not, but if you are, I think it will be a great little bag. Also, my teenage daughter sometimes uh, borrows it, and um, they tend to carry little things that we older women, or more experienced women, <laughs> um, carry. So um, it's great for teenagers as well. Um, maybe for a concert, uh, you know, little trips like that, it's great. And like I said, if you're a minimalist, this might be just the right bag for you. I, when I purchased it, I had no intention of buying it at all. Like I never really pay attention to this bag, but it was on sale. And so I was like, well, like might as well. I wanted something in Baroque, but I didn't want something that I would have to, you know, carry every day just in case I did not like it. So I thought maybe hmm, a little evening bag in Baroque would not be good. And I haven't regretted it. It's really, really cute bag. I don't know if I mentioned this uh this little uh, stripe in there, decorative stripe, it's uh, really cute. It has the leaves um, that you see in the rest of the pattern. So this is my little review of the little flap hipster. I 100% recommend this bag. It's really cute. I really love it. It uh, does its job, which is evening outings for me. So if you have any more questions, uh, don't hesitate and put them right at the bottom. And please subscribe to my channel. I hope you guys have a, you guys have a wonderful summer. Bye-bye.